Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much again for stopping by. And today I thought I would do um, an unboxing that I promised from my last video. So today um, it's really exciting for me because these are two items that I do not have in my collection. Um, I've never been interested in getting them just because I thought they would be too small for me. But um, I've been wanting to get... I Basically, I decided, well, I've been kind of burdened sometimes with the heaviness of bags, so I want these two as an option for quick trips, because oftentimes I'm running out the door just to go for lunch somewhere, and I just, you know, and sometimes I take a hike, so it's really good to have something really lightweight for that, and more practical. So I thought I would go on ahead and do this unboxing, so let's get right on into it. Oh, and I got this from I Love Dooney, by the way. Unbox this. Now the box is a little on the small side, so I hope it's not too packed in there for what I got. Since I got two items. Okay. Alrighty. Take that out. Ooh, not too bad. Okay, so let's take out the first item. Okay. So this is the Dunium Burke. Um, Florentine fold over zip crossbody in the color pale blue. <gasps> Look at this quantity one of one. So they just made one of these. Mind you, I um, purchased this whenever, like, um, when they put all that old stuff back on the website, that kind of a deal. They only last for like a day or so. So maybe they just make one at a time. You guys let me know whenever they do that. So, and she's a keeper, so. I'm gonna cut into the outside plastic. It's cute. One of one, I've never gotten a one of one before, so that is cool. Okay. Okay. Ooh, this is cute, look at that. Yeah, you can see that, and it's a little bit lighter in person. So let's just take off the plastic. And the tassel, I'm noticing it's thinner and shorter than the kind you have on any of the Florentine satchels. Um, so that's something. I wish it was a little bigger. I don't know. That's just me. So let's show you. Okay. Strap is extra long, you guys. So, But you can make it shorter. So here she is. Oh, and she's smooth. So. She features, obviously, it's a zip, fold over zip, and it has a back slip pocket. And there's a little tag. So I like that for maybe a phone or something. So let's open it up. So you do get four magnets here. Oh, I didn't know that. There's a, there's a, oh, duh. So this is where there is six card slots right in there. So once you open the bag, that's what you see. Then you open up the main compartment like this. Piece of foam, two pieces of foam. I don't know if you can see that, it's kind of dark, but it is pretty small. There's one back a zip pocket, so you could put you know little things in there. But yeah, it's so simple, you guys. Um, and I love the fact that it has a magnet, magnetic closure, so it's easy to get in and out of you know where you put your cards. Smells amazing, but yeah, they only made one of one. But yeah, just for on the go. I really need that. Okay, so let's do the next item. Ooh, the color, this is kind of different. All right, here she is. This is the Dean and Burke um, Belvedere crossbody pouch in the color Caribbean Blue. Now this color, as it's coming across in person and on the camera, Caribbean, I've had a bag in Caribbean blue before, but it was lighter than this. So this is darker, but oh well. And I'm going to keep her. So, does it say... I don't know if it says... It didn't come with one of these. Maybe I'll keep looking for it. Okay, this is hard to open. I'm going to go ahead and keep it. Okay. This is cute. Oh my goodness. I mean it. Oh my. Oh, so here's the front. Okay. Oh, it's lovely. Let's see if you can see that. 
Yes, and it's coming off true to color in person. So there's your little zipper there, and it's like a brown tomorrow color. The only thing I noticed right away is the opening is pretty small. Okay, there's your crossbody strap, matches the trim. Key fob, really short though. But yeah, I don't know. It didn't come with one of these, so it's kind of weird. I'm curious if it was a one of one as well. <laughs> okay. Smells fine, smells normal. Nothing funky going on. Okay, so what you have is a back zip pocket here. Sorry if it's a little dark. And then you have just one slip pocket in the front. So there's only one slip pocket. And that's pretty good for your essentials in my opinion. You could fit a wallet in there. Maybe not like the large ones at all. But yeah, and a phone and maybe a lipstick. And this is perfect for on the go for me. Let's go ahead and open this real quick. I love it. Okay. I've always wanted this bag, you guys. I just never pulled the trigger on it. But let me know if you guys have one and what you think of it. So here's the strap. Okay. It's really uh, stiff leather, so I'm going to condition that later. Okay. It's kind of a shorter... Nope, it's a long crossbody strap. It's adjustable, but here it is. Very stiff. I just love a contrasting um, trim with this. But yeah, here it is. There's no feet on the bottom, though. And here's the back. Make sure you can see that. So yeah, this bag comes in a lot of different colors. Like I said, they add the most colors whenever they add those bags and items on the site that are really old that they only bring out um, every now and then. So keep an eye out for that. It often comes in the color mauve, which I'm interested in getting possibly. I just wish it was like more of a pink color because I've seen other YouTubers put it up on YouTube and it's kind of this purpley, but I still might get it. Um, plus, these two bags don't take up a lot of room at all in my collection because as I said before, I've just realized I'm like, well, I'm running out of room. Plus, I have, so I have like a storage unit, a small one, and like six months ago, it was one price, right? And then exactly six months that I've had it, they up the price, the monthly rent. And I get it, like some places do that, but like, I just don't like the principle of it. Like, I'm just, you know, I want my rate to stay the same. It hasn't even been a year. So what I'm doing is since there's not a ton of stuff in there, I'm taking out the stuff and moving it to different storage places I have um, or storage options. So I'm going to ask family member if I could put a couple of boxes up there and they're not even using that room. So, um, and the storage I have where I'm living now, um, I'm running out of room for all my lovely bags. So that's why I'm selling stuff. So um, once again, you can visit my shop on Poshmark. It's NFPDX556, um, but I'll link that below. Yeah, just give it a check. Um, check it all now. Um, I put some other stuff on there that I didn't mention, so um, take a look um, what I put up there. And I always put really detailed photos of what kind of condition they're in. Some of my bags, like I've used them for years, so you'll see kind of the wear and tear. But some of them I put on there, they're in pretty, pretty good condition, like very good. But I love this. I just love this color with the trim. I know I'm doing a long video, but this is cute. And once again, oh, she fell down. Um, here's this one. I love this. I just love contrasting red and it's so smooth. So they're both, I'm just excited. I love like little itty bitty things, you know, even though I like to have a bag that's bigger than this, but this is what I need for on the go. And I'm trying to save space and I've just really realized that so but yeah let me know what you guys think um, if you guys have these bags let me know what you put in them um, and what you think about them so yeah I hope you guys are doing well let me know how your guys this week have been going and yeah thank you so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the bell notification so you can get reminded for next time I post so yeah I'll talk to you guys soon bye